Petroleum Sarawak Berhad Petros will install a reliable and safe gas pipeline for 135 more low-income households in Quarter Duplex Taman Ceria QTC Permajaya in Miri as part of its Phase 2 project. Premier of Sarawak, Dato' Patinki Tan Sri Dr. Abang Abdul Rahman Zuhari Tun Dato' Abang Openg stated that the QTC project is progressing well and is scheduled for completion by 2025. According to him, once the project is fully implemented, it is expected to benefit over 3,000 households in the area. I am pleased to announce that in February of this year, Petros has successfully completed the first phase of a significant multi-phase infrastructure project to deliver safe reliable and affordable pipe gas to 13 lower income households in quadruplex quadruplex taman ceria in pemajaya i am also pleased to inform that petras shall cover all installation costs for the necessary gas pipelines to deliver pipe gas directly to your kitchen. Shabbat and well done to Petros team. That is our ambition that it is not only in Pumajaya and perhaps throughout Sarawak, you don't have to carry the tank anymore. He made these remarks during a dinner event celebrating the 7th anniversary of Petros held at the Borneo Convention Centre, Kuching, on Wednesday. In the same speech, Dato' Patinki Abang Zohari announced that Petros will also launch a new initiative aimed at enhancing the marketability of graduates in Sarawak. This specially curated programme will immerse students in a comprehensive curriculum that integrates skill development, mindset training, and a career focus pathway. Earlier, while speaking, Petros Chairman Tan Sri Dato Amar Dr Hamid Bugo stated that the anniversary celebration not only reflects Petros's significant achievements, but also reinforces its commitment to driving sustainable growth and improving the quality of life for the people of Sarawak. He noted that this includes contributions to the health sector, infrastructure projects and the launch of the Petros Train and Place program aimed at developing local talent in the energy sector.